directly favorite Johannes Radebe has told how, following a performance in front of thousands of fans, he was stopped by police who claimed he looked suspicious. The professional dancer, 36, revealed he was approached by officers while he was in outside a venue after a show on the Strictly Live tour. In his highly anticipated memoir Jojo, Finally Home, he says it felt like a slap in the face. Johannes, who was on the phone to his mum at the time, says, a police van pulled up into the parking lot where I was sitting. Two officers got of the car. I said, Mummy, they are walking over to me. What did you do wrong? She asked. I felt stung. Nothing, I said. When they came over I showed my ID. Is there something wrong? I asked one of them. No, you look suspicious and like someone we are looking for. Maybe they were doing their job but the fact I'd just been on stage with thousands of people shouting my name and now I was being approached by police who thought I could be a criminal felt like a slap in the face. Johannes admitted the incident in Aberdeen in 2019 blighted the positivity of the Strictly stage shows for a few hours. But he added, regardless, I wrapped up the tour oozing positive energy. The South African is one of the most popular dancers with viewers and has previously spoken about being stopped by police. In 2021, he said he was stopped all the time, describing it as terrible and saying he has to be careful with what he wears. According to figures in 2020, black people in England and Wales are nine times more likely than white people to face stop and search. Johannes joined Strictly in 2018 and in 2021 he partnered John White as the first all-male partnership in Strictly history. Last year he was paired with actor Ellie Taylor. Jojo, finally home is out now.